be afraid. No, I won't be afraid. Just as long as you stand. Stand by me. Stand by me. Stand by me. Stand by me. And darling, darling, stand by me. Oh, stand by me. Just as long as you stand. Stand by me. Let's see why you have to practice on me. You're getting it free, aren't you? Sometimes. I liked it long too, it just looked funny. <laughs> Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> you like it? I love it. No, really, really, this is true. I'm reading it right here in the paper, right here. It says the mother of Italy's latest kidnapping victim said yesterday she was not interested in her daughter or in paying any ransom, however small. You're gonna get me fired, you know that, don't you? Nah, the hands are faster than the eye. What you didn't see, is of what you didn't either. Just like my fastball. Yeah. You're gonna give him heart failure. Savucci? He ain't got no heart. Hey, Billy, you pitching tonight? Yeah, we'll see you tonight, huh? Take your balls for the game, man. Hey, looks nice. I'm great! <laughs> Doing you a favor by keeping it on. It's not so bad. I know. I could have ended up looking like Salvucci. Ball. The <laughs> <laughs> guys are right now. No. The corners are moving. Go, 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 go. Let's go throw them the heat, Bell. Come on, Bell.
slow, sucker. Yeah. Come on, hey, man. Hey, 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 hey. that ball in that yeah. ugly's mouth. Hey, get the lead up, Jerome, will you? My arm's kind of sore. Hey, listen, don't worry about it. Ethan's up. He's kind of scared of the ball, so kind of pitch him a little high and tight, OK? Yeah, OK. okay. Ethan, what's up? What's up? What are you doing? Come on, let's get this jump out of here. Let's go, Ethan, baby. Hey, hey, boom that ball. Come on, Ethan. Come on, Ethan, Donna, baby. Donna, I want to home right now. Let's Let's beat go. it, will ya? Goes the game. Come on, Ethan, yeah. <laughs> Jimmy's coming up tonight. So, so she wants you to sit Tommy. Oh, my. <laughs> deal what she wants. Oh, well, and she'll get all mad at me. You screw and go home. Hey, just tell her you didn't see me, all right? No, well, I did see her. Terry, did you hear what your sister told you? Oh, mind your own business, will ya? Oh, Johnny, she is wise. Leave it alone, metal mouth. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> go play with your paper dolls. Come on! Let's be careful with that ball, man. And be careful with your own, all right? Don't worry about it. I'm not worrying. Come on, Ethan! Hit one for me, babe! Here we go! Are you still going? Yeah, and we're gonna boogie tonight. Come on, honey! Do it up! Nice butt. Don't tell him that. Ah, <laughs> uh, you can handle it. Wouldn't I just like to try? <laughs> Teeth back in your head, man. You're blinding me. Yeah, you step over here and I'll dazzle you. Right. Yeah, hey, play ball, will ya? Goes it, donut. <laughs> All right, you just get here. Yes, yeah, sick of God. L.A., Fort Worth, Omaha, Chicago. Six days on the road, I'm beat. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you bring? Pigs mostly. <laughs> Get some scrap iron from L.A. God, them pigs stink. You should have heard them squeal some. Whoa, it is all Oh, for me. You? Oh yeah. Yeah, you know some son of a bitch took a shot at me down on I-40? Bang, just like that, out of nowhere. That some bitches won't leave you alone. You get scared? No. I know I got something somewhere. Oh, yeah, something to hold your britches up hey. with. <laughs> Donna, twice, all right? <laughs> <laughs> Who's winning? The bad guys. Billy pitching? <laughs> yeah. If you can call it that. <laughs> Your mama home? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I guess. See you later. Hey, wait a minute. Uh oh. Hey. Oh God. Oh. No, oh thanks. God. See you later. Yeah. Oh. Here. Don't tell her you saw me, okay? Oh yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Have a good time. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Hey, Brian. Hey, give me a break. I'm coming, all right? 
Hey, you got some money, right? Man, you got the money and you know it. Where you on, playing you games, huh? Don't be playing no games. You got my money to owe me. Oh, Give up the money. Give up the money. Hey, you doing? You have a cigarette? Hey, get out of here, no, I ain't asking you. Get a Not job, for you. Boss. Get a cigarette. Bye. Give me a cigarette, will ya? Bye. Don't be an asshole. God. Boy, close. Close. That was right. Hey, who's winning this time? Baltimore, four to two. It's goddamn Red Sox. <laughs> it's the pitcher. Hey, uh, who's all this stuff for? My friend. Your friend's all right. Yeah, you guys look like you're having a big night tonight. Your sister Marlene's not out there tonight, is she? Uh, well, we ain't seen her. You haven't seen her? Mm -hmm. You know your parents don't like her out there drinking. You better watch yourselves. Come on, Mr. Thomas. She's a big girl. You know, all, all grown up, you know? Right, right. She's all grown up, all right. That'll be 420. 420, Dad. 420. What do you say you let me owe it? Hey, man, you can't have no credit. This is a business. You gotta work hard for this money. I'm not paying for you and your friends to go out and get drunk. By the way, uh, who won the game tonight? We won. You won, huh? Yeah, a guy just came in here and told me that you also had a fight. We weren't fighting. We were just playing a game. That's all. It was just a game. Just playing all right. You guys keep playing like that. When are you gonna get hurt?
Come on, I gotta go home and take a shower. Take care of my beautiful self. Go cool off, will ya? Be quiet, you maggots. this what this well that it's a new belt you get a new belt huh yeah i got a new belt what's it to you gotta have something to keep my pants up <laughs> i don't see why hey ethan hey ethan you up there hey man get your black ass down here hey keep it down where ya? hey don't worry about it all right yeah. Hey, you seen Ethan? Nope. Hey, Ethan! What's he want? He's gonna go dance on the Hey, Ethan! Ethan, you up here, man? Discussing. Oh, I don't remember. Geez, some memory you got. I believe you were expressing some interest in my new belt. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, where was I? Lovebirds. Must be mating season down there, huh? Beat it, will you? Hey, where's everybody? They went dancing. Without me? Brian was looking for you. Damn him. Why don't you run along now? Huh, I ain't bothering no one. You're bothering me. Hey, Donna, am I bothering you? Yeah, you're bothering her. What's the matter, man? Can't she speak for herself, ma'am? She breathless? I'm talking. Beat it. That's your roof, man. Besides, man, I want to practice my singing. Yeah? Somewhere over the rainbow, way up high. Hey, that was some pitching tonight. Practically took my damn head off. Man. Not too late. Is that a threat? Huh? No, uh, that's a fact. Yeah, Give them empty words. <laughs> oh, no, it's all right. Mm -hmm. Let's go, OK? Thing. Yeah. What you He's say, drunk. Why don't you go home, man? Come on down. Yeah. Drunk. Woo. Hey, Billy, man. Seriously, man. Billy, were you screwing her, man? Shut up, Ethan. Stop being such a jerk. <laughs> hey, I hope you're better at that than you are with your pitching, man. You know? Could Leave be dangerous, alone. man. Come on down, Billy. Lady killer. Ha <laughs> ha. Hey, Donna. Donna! Is he better than me? <laughs> Get it, Billy. What are you doing? I'm getting out of here. Ooh. What's the matter? He's insulting. I don't care. I yeah. do. Can't take a little inside of it. Huh? Come on, Billy, let's talk. I don't want to hear it anymore, okay? Talking trash to her. 
You know, poking my pitch, and I don't want to hear it, Ethan. I'm sick of it. Come on, man. Leave him alone, Billy. Come on. What can I do? He's drunk. Get him off. Please. Ethan, get down off Come on, you get down. What am I going to do? We'll Molly. What am I going to do? You get can't off. do nothing. Get me what you going to do. Ethan, it's me, Billy. Come on. Yeah, it's me, Ethan. Yeah, what's up, man? Come on, man. Come on, come on yeah, down. Come, come on up. Come on. Come on up, man. <laughs> <laughs> Scared you, huh? What's wrong? Ethan, huh? come on. Oh. Ethan! <laughs> Ethan! Donna, Donna, it's me. Did you see him? I couldn't, couldn't get in there. Too many cops. I didn't do it. I slept as well. Do you think he's... I don't know. I don't know. I couldn't see him. Was there an ambulance? Yeah. They took him. They took him. He was drunk, you know? Drunk. Well, at least there was an ambulance. Probably he'll be okay. I guess. He shouldn't have been out there doing that like that up there. He's drunk. Fucking jerk. What's the matter with him? Don't say nothing to nobody. I won't say nothing. We'll see what happens. Don't say nothing. You want to stay? No, I got to get out of here. Tommy will sleep. They're never going to believe it. If they find out, you know what happened? But I didn't touch him. I didn't touch him. I know. Damn him. Fucking up my life. Probably he'll be okay. Yeah. See ya. See ya. Really pissed at you last night. 
Give me a break, will ya? Well, it was our turn, you know. Hi, Ma. Somebody give me a hand with this bag? I'm sorry he's wet, but I'm late. Um, I got some yogurt in the bag for his lunch, no hamburger. And don't give him any cookies, okay? They're empty calories. There's too much sugar in them, and they make them hyper. And there's a uh, couple of bananas in there for a snack. <clears throat> and I'll see you at five. Great. Bye. Well, I'm surprised to see you up in time for work. Or maybe I'm the only one you come in late for. Bye, Ma. I'm sorry, Ma. I got one who comes in four hours late and one who thinks I'm gonna poison her baby. You know what your trouble is? You're selfish, the two of you. Well, it wasn't my turn. All I know is it was my turn to go out, but oh no. I had to stay home and watch Johnny Carson reruns. When can we expect you home tonight, young lady? Mm. I bet you if we take the cruise with the way it is right now, huh? I bet you. All right? Yeah. We go next door. It wouldn't even get a sticker out there. It wouldn't even pass the sticker. We didn't get a sticker. Yeah, we get connections in high places against the sticker. Well, I wish you I could get a sticker. What was all that time? noise last night after the project? Wow. All them sirens. Oh, no, no. The guy fell off the roof. Did he get hurt? What, three stories up? I, I guess he got hurt, yeah. He didn't fly down, right? What's that all about? What? The detective is upstairs to see Brian. Oh, yeah? Big black guy. Mm. You can't stay out of trouble.
anything I can do for you? No, honey, just run my own. Okay. Well, anything you need, just call me. Bye. How is he? It's bad. It's real bad. I couldn't even see. It's just all whys and stuff. It made me sick to my stomach. The weirdest thing about it is he broke his neck. His neck? How could this happen? Why did he even go back there? What was up there? I can't understand it. He was kind of drunk, you know. Somebody must have been up there. Where was anybody? Where was Brian? Where the hell was anybody? I don't know. Come on, let's go home. I'll take you home, all right? I want to find Brian. Well, maybe he's home. Come on, I'll take you. I'm going to the factory. Fine. Right now? Are you sure you just don't want to go home? I'm going to find Brian. Tickling her insides a little bit. She likes a little fooling around with now and again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, Lord. Plunk. You go to Texas? Day after tomorrow, huh? Against company rules. You always play by the rules? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'd like to go to Texas. Oh, yes, yeah, real pretty out there, all flat. You ever know anybody who broke their neck? I know a lot of necks I'd like to break. Why? Do you die? Well, I hear it's not too good for your health. Why do you ask? You like to drive? Oh, let's put it this way. I like moving, but I don't like walking. That's the best part. Your body's moving, but your body's not working. That's the part I like best. When are you going to teach me how to drive this thing, huh? As soon as you get strong enough. It's a bitch. I'm strong! Oh, God! Oh! Oh, you little half of you. Now, look Please. at that. Oh, God. Yeah, it's pretty good. I feel like it. It's disgusting. <clears> Hi, <throat> <laughs> Mom. If you're done admiring Mr. America there, I could use your strong arm in the kitchen. When you finish putting the dishes away, could you put Tommy to bed? Pretty good show for the neighbors. Oh, don't get dressed on my account. I thought we were going out. You can talk Donna into sitting with Tom and try. She seems to listen to you. What are you going to get me for my birthday? Your birthday? Next week. I get one same as everyone else. What would you like? I'd like to be 10 years younger. 
I'm gonna have a hard time being 40. Well, you're not gonna be, not for a while yet, not for a couple of years. Yeah, well, soon. I'm just warning you. Well, what do I gotta do, prepare myself? Stop looking at young girls. Oh, Marianne, you look good. You think so? Of course I do, can't you tell? Good enough you'll stick around a couple more days, help me celebrate my birthday? I gotta go, huh? It's only a couple of days, Jimmy. I gotta go to work, pay off the truck. I gotta. Yeah. Come on. Give me a break, will you? <laughs> I guess I just got a little sad thinking about my birthday. Well, let's go have a beer. We celebrate now. What do you say? All right. I think it's a choke, maybe. It's stuck. I don't know. It might be this. Back. I don't know. If you guys just give me a chance, I'll hey, get in there and show on, you what man. it is. Sorry. Hey, you on, get a chance. To get Clowns don't know what you're doing. <laughs> Look at this. I can't well, believe this. Hey, I thought you said it was just a wire. Okay, hey, every wire yeah. is connected to another damn wire, you know. <laughs> but I think this may be, um, do a great pan around the. Here. All right. And then let's find the building and do one from maybe the bottom. Do you want me to go up on the roof? Yeah. Yeah. What is that? Hey, what's this shit? Yeah. Listen, does anyone uh, know what happened here the other night? Hey, what are you, some kind of investigative reporter or something? <laughs> we just came down to get a little background. Oh, background, huh? Yeah. yeah. Background for what? Uh, the scene of the crime. Crime? What crime? So they you know, the boy crime? fell. It must mean the accident. Right. Yeah. Yes. Does anybody know which building he fell from? I don't know. I, I think know. it was this one right over here. Over here? Hey, what's the matter with you? It was this one right here. Background. What's the difference, you know? <laughs> it's all the same, right? Early, ugly American brick. Yeah. <laughs> don't pay any attention to them. It was that one right there. This one over here? Yeah. Your Lisa. So what are you going to do? Take some pictures of the garbage and the broken windows and stuff like that? Yeah, really. Yeah, How the other half lived? What really happened? Had an accident. He had a bad act. <laughs> I thought he was pushed. Hey, he fell. That's not what the police say. Oh, yeah? Well, if the police say he was pushed, I mean, he must have been pushed. They ought to know, right? They're the police. That's what they get paid for, you know? I thought they were looking for a suspect. Hey, tell mm -hmm. me, why are the cops looking for Brian? He wasn't even up there. The police say they have a witness that uh, saw him go up there. Hey, what's the matter? Don't they have any crime anyplace else? Yeah, why don't you go over to Bridal Street? Take a few pictures uh, over that's there, so you know? Interesting. Yeah. Just ain't picturesque, you know? There's no garbage. No garbage, man. No really. broken glass. Broken glass. Yeah, it's not like the estates here, huh? <laughs> yeah, no punks. Hey, come on, I'm no punk. Hey, what are you going to say? Young man killed in an urban jungle. <laughs> A gang of vicious white dope fiends. Yeah, we <laughs> <With, laughs> <with, with laughs> racist frenzy <laughs> and alcohol and waves tonight. Sucks, man. Take an innocent black youth and throw him off the roof. Hey, but after all, what can you expect from these ignorant people? You're all animals. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all for talking to us. You have been very yeah, helpful. Great. 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 Why don't you talk to the housing authority yeah. about why there's no railing up on the roof? Yeah, yeah. when well, are they going to fix that anyway? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Would, you, um, would you mind repeating that? No, I don't mind hey. saying it. Hey. OK, chance, if you want a story, why don't you find out why the housing authority doesn't have a railing up on the roof? OK, nice. Thanks. Yeah, they're up all over the other place. Nice, all of you. Listen, thanks a bunch. Oh, you're welcome. Hey, are you going to be on TV okay. tonight? Probably watching hey. the Oh, watch out. Hey, make sure you get me in there. Bye-bye, yeah. <laughs> anytime you need to go action, you know. Relax, well, more to anything. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 You gotta help me. Just 
see him. Hey, Tommy, look at that big turtle. Why don't you go look at him? Who? Ethan, at the hospital. No, Marlene told me. Maybe he'll be all right. Billy, he broke his neck. He could live. Yeah, he could die, too. I don't want him to die. Well, I'm just not saying shut up that. about it, okay? But if he does, nobody will know. Yeah. And Brian will go to jail. They'll never convict him. Come on. He already lost his job. They might. They could. You want me to go to jail? Of course not. Because that's what's going to happen. They find out I was up there. Well, they're not going to find out. Keep talking to Marlene. They will. I was up there. On the roof. With Ethan? Look. I went up there, I tried to call you. You didn't answer, so I left. That was it. I didn't even see Ethan. Well, what do you want me to do? I need some money. I don't have much. Five, six dollars. Did you do it? got to do with it? Black kid falls, fighting with white kid. I'll be in Bill Rick until I'm 90. You didn't do nothing, Billy. Neither did Brian. Who's going to believe it? We were fighting before. I'm white, he's black. I got a record. It's color. It's no game. I know. I know, I know, I know. We're start living in the real world. Donna. There must have been somebody up there. It must have been Billy or Donna. They said they left. They're lying. They were up there. Now look, you talk to Donna. Okay, she's your friend. You talk to her, all right? But Donna wouldn't do it. Look, you talk to Donna. I gotta go, okay? But Brian. Talk to Donna. Brian. Everyone. What's with you two? That detective's back again. And he wants to see you this time. What do you want me for? You tell me. What am I gonna lose you two? No. Oh. Hi, Billy. Hi. Tom Reynolds. You wanna sit down? Tom. Oh. You seen Brian? No, he didn't come in today. You seen him the other day up on the roof? No. I thought you and Don were up there dancing. No. Oh, well, that's what I heard. <laughs> no. Did you see him yesterday? No. You got changed for a dollar? What? Yeah. Sure. Want coke? Oh, thanks. You know, your friend Brian's in a lot of trouble. Caffeine. Gotta have it. What do you think happened? What should I know? I guess he had an accident. Fell off. An accident? Yeah, I wasn't there. No? Oh, yeah. You know, you know what's wrong with that? It doesn't satisfy. You know what I mean? It's human nature. Something bad happens, it's got to be somebody's fault. You know what I mean? There has to be a villain. No gas? 
The guy driving the car blames the president. The president blames the Arabs. The Arabs blame the oil companies. It can't be that there just ain't no gas. Somebody's got to point that finger. Yeah. So? Ethan died. When? This morning. So am I. I don't know what it is. A black kid gets killed, and nobody knows anything. It's an accident. I agree, but I'm not the boss. And what you and I might happen to think isn't going to impress anybody. I still got this one. I got to show on Brian. In the absence of anything stronger than our opinions. I'll bet you Brian ain't feeling too good about it either. You go on back to work, Billy, and you keep yourself out of trouble. Earlier this afternoon at Cambridge City Hospital, a young black teenager died after a fall from a three-story project roof. Police believe that young Ethan Thomas was pushed to his death, and iView News has learned that they do have a suspect in the case. Project residents had this to say. We are very concerned here, in light of this incident, that there be a thorough investigation conducted by the authorities. There is a history of racial violence here, and we are sure that this is another one of those related events. It's just bull, man. They're just going to some brother. Something bad happens, and he comes down on us. That's the way it always is. They should look at their own houses for a change. If you want a story, talk to the housing authority and find out why there's no railing up on that roof. Yeah, very yeah. Nice. A look at the statistics bore out what was apparent.
Give me another one. Sure. Marlene. Bartender. Damn, this place is getting kind of crowded, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Well, Stuffy. <laughs> the quality of customers has gone way down. <laughs> Marlene, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. It's all kinds of scum in here these days. Ain't no place for no self-respecting black person on the right. Why are you gonna be so cold? Marlene, I'm sorry about you. All right? Don't touch me. Come on. Hey, come on. Hey, hey, come on. 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 Hey, come Not like you think you know. It didn't happen. Shut up. It was an accident. I want to hear from your mouth. You gotta. You gotta understand. I gotta understand what I understand, and I understand you're some lying bitch. Brian didn't do it. Tell it to the cops. Brian was up there, but he left. He Tell it to the damn anything. cops. Marlene, don't you understand? I can't help. Girl, you've had some strange I sense of reality. Marlene, please help me. <laughs> don't seem like such a big problem to me. I mean, keep doing what you're doing. Keep your mouth shut and let Brian go to jail. Let him take the fall. That's real good, Dawn, real good. You don't understand. I don't understand. I understand, all right. Ethan gets killed, Brian gets arrested. Nobody can wait to get him in jail. Get the black kid. Just a bunch of crazy niggas killing each other off. Lock him up and throw away the door key. What do you think would happen to Bill if they found out he was up there? He was up there, wasn't he? What do you think would happen? He was up there. What do you think would happen to Billy, huh? Oh, to tell you the truth, I really don't give a shit. He ought to stand up and take the heat. Because Brian's going down for something he didn't do know how. And that's the crime. You can't do that. You can't do that to him. Oh, Donnie, you're just like the rest of them. You ain't no different. You're just out to save your ass. Nobody's ever going to believe that Billy didn't kill him. I don't want to hear it. I was there, Marlene. Billy didn't do nothing. He didn't touch him. He tried to help. Marlene, I was there. I saw it, all right? Well, if you were there, then tell it to the cops. I can't. Donna, tell it to the damn I cops. I can't, Marlene. I can't. <laughs> Three girls. I didn't think I was going to have these kinds of problems. 
Little Tommy stuffed a plastic fish down the toilet. <laughs> Water all over the place. I told Jimmy, I says, you go down there. As far as I'm concerned, she can just stay there. Rot. <laughs> Oh, no. He's not going to stir himself. He's got to get his beauty sleep. So he can drive to Texas. Unlike me, of course, who doesn't need any sleep. Doesn't do anything all day long. Just take care of everybody else's all. Is he coming back? I don't know. Want a coffee? Light. I'll have it here, okay? I hear you had a little trouble the other night. A and B on an officer. Fighting? Yeah. Molly? I got this feeling you know the answer to all these questions. What were you fighting about? Nothing. Oh, gee. Everybody went around fighting about nothing. We'd have our hands full, wouldn't we? I guess. Where's Brian? I don't know. Why don't you ask Marlene? I did. Ethan died. I heard. Maybe it was an accident. You mean he just fell off the roof all by himself? No, you know, maybe they were fooling around. They? Us. Whoever. Fooling around. You know, up on the roof. You mean Ethan around. and Brian? Yeah, well, maybe. Fooling around? You know, up on the roof. Maybe they were fooling around, fighting. What were they fighting about? I don't know. Maybe about Marlene. Now that's funny, because Billy had the same theory. You did? Mm-hmm. About an accident and Marlene. Well, that's what I heard, you know. Mm -hmm. That it was an accident. Brian's no killer. Donna, neither is Billy. What? Listen, Donna, why don't you and I take a little ride and see Billy? Brian was up there. So were you. So was Billy. Brian left. You guys didn't. Now, that's the way it must have been. So what do you want me to do about it? What do you think, Donna? Talk to Billy? I can't talk to Billy. Somebody's got to. Yeah, but he didn't do nothing. I believe that. Well, no one else is gonna. He's gonna do time for this, you know? That's a chance he's gotta take. Why should he? Why should Brian? He then was drunk. You were there. He slipped. He just disappeared off the roof. Nobody pushed him. He was really drunk. Was Billy there? You don't give a shit about him, do you? You just want to pin it on somebody, get Brian off, hang it on some white kid, be a big hero, right? Look, Donna, I don't want to hear that shit from you. I could have picked Billy up yesterday and booked him. I didn't because I don't think he did it. I don't think Brian did it. Now, we got a problem here, you and me. This is an imperfect world. There's a lot of folks don't care about the difference between slipped and pushed. There's a lot of people want to see a black kid take the heat for this. A lot of people want to see it on a white kid. Now, where's the justice in that? You tell me. I'm a cop. I'm supposed to arrest somebody. I'm not even sure there's a crime to arrest anybody for. We arrest a black kid, we're a bunch of racist pigs. We arrest a white kid, we start a race riot. We don't arrest anybody, 
We're a bunch of corrupt incompetents. What do you want me to do? Sign a deposition. What's it going to say? You were there. You saw Brian. Brian left. That's all? That's all. Nothing else? We got a witness that says Brian wasn't there. We can't hold him. What about Billy? He's got a problem. You gonna arrest him? Maybe you ought to say something to him. Then I'll sign the papers. Look, Donna, you got dealt a pretty bad hand, but you got to play it the way it is. We both do. I thought this was my truck. Uh -huh. You want a lift? You going my way? Texas. Well, that's quite an invitation. I got an offer here you can't refuse. You got to tell me something, honey. Were you even back there all this time, sneaking and hiding around you, sneak you? Oh, <laughs> God. You know, kind of cramped in there. It smells like onions. Uh-huh. Disgusting. I like it up here, though. It's nice being up high. Oh, yeah? Yep. Did you tell anybody? Nope. No. It's just you and me, huh? Yep. You didn't say nothing? Nope. Oh, my god. You must be out of your mind. <laughs> oh, my god. You know something? You sure are pushy for a young kid. I just want to get to Texas, that's all. Okay, partner. You want me to drive? Let her rip. Texas? Oh, yeah, and Hoboken and Delaware and Shreveport and Abilene, pulpwood and toxic waste. Ooh-hoo. I'm going to drive. Yeah, you sure in the driver's seat, honey. Come on, Timmy, get serious. Serious? I am serious. What the hell you think this is, a bus? Go! I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna lay right back here and take myself a little nap. And when we get to Hoboken, you wake me up, okay? 
I can't drive this thing. You can't drive. If you can't drive, then what the hell are you doing in a truck? I mean, what the hell? I thought you were grown up. Grown up enough to, you know, drive a truck. Grown up enough to leave home. Just got to get out of there, that's all. Come on, Donna. Let's go call your mother. Where you going? You can't. Come on, you can't. I got to call your mother. Listen to me. You can't do that. You. What's the matter? Are you in trouble? What, Billy? What did you get arrested for last night? Look, Don, I don't want a lot of damn cops descending on me. You can't understand that. All right. Yeah. Now, wait a minute. You're I didn't... You're going to hitchhike. Just let listen, me go. Listen, I didn't mean that. You don't want me around. I'm not going to be around, okay? Oh, come on, honey. No, listen. Take it easy, Don. Look at you. Thought we were friends. Come on. Damn. Hell with Texas and all that stuff. Let's go cool off. What do you say? What's the matter? Mr. Barrett. Oh, God. Friends fight, Nana. What you worry about? Get up in that truck. Come on, babe. I brought your mom up here a couple of times. What about us kids, huh? You're no kid. Glad you noticed. I noticed, believe me. you anyway? How old are you? That's different. <coughs> Great big crab. Can you want to get me? <laughs> Come on, cowboy, give me a hug. <laughs> Just a little You're squeeze. You're getting goosebumps. <laughs> Come on. No. <laughs> Just a little yeah. one. Deep in the heart of Texas. Cold feet, warm heart. Having fun? Yeah, never looked at your hair. Let me see. Oh, big gray spot there. And you're getting bald. I am not. Yes, you are. It's receding all the way back to here. It Look is at that. Not. Two inches. Don't you think your mama's gonna be worried about you? Huh? No, I'm getting real sick of hearing about my mother. <laughs> Listen. As soon as we give, get to down to Texas, we'll give her a phone call. Long distance, she'll like that. They got pay phones there, don't they? Yep. So, what's the problem? How long until we get to Texas, anyway? We see the Rockies first? Mountains with snow on top? Mountain roads? <laughs> you know, I don't think I've ever been anywhere. Yeah, I have. I went to Providence once. And we were going to go to New York City, except Terry got sick. Figures. Check it out. You know, i never even been to New York City. Isn't that pathetic? Mm -hmm. Look at these. Okay. Pictures, huh? Mm -hmm. <sighs>
little one with blonde hair. She's cute. Yeah. This must be uh, Susan, right? No, that's, that's uh, Becky. And her elder sister? Redhead. That's Joanne. No, Lori. And skinny guy with the big teeth that looks a lot like his dad. That must be Jimmy Jr. Right? No, that's Buck. Buck! Oh, that's real sweet. Lay off. Wow, what a darling family you got, Jimmy. You think we never knew. It's not nice. <laughs> what do you think they'll do when I get down to Texas, huh? Well, I guess it'll be all right. You can just introduce me as the daughter of your girlfriend, right? Grow up, will you? Well, I'll get along just fine. What am I supposed to do, Jimmy? Huh? Thanks a lot. Thanks a whole lot. You know what there is down there? There's cars down there, hundreds of them rusting away. You think there's fish in there? Too dark for fish. I bet there is fish. Blind fish. Could be fish, but they'd be blind. That's OK. Don't need to see to swim. I'll bet there's bodies down there. Dead people? In the cars. They send a diver down every once in a while, but he can't see nothing. Fish probably eat them. That's probably what they live on. What do you think happens when you die? You think it all just stops? It's so weird. All of a sudden, you're just gone, like nothing ever happened. Donna. You gonna tell your mother? You asking me? I really liked her, you know. Really? Yeah, I just didn't know how. She's hard to talk to. Hard as nails, your mother. It's in her eyes. You've got them, her eyes. <laughs> oh, yeah? Spooky. Bullshit. You got beautiful eyes. Jimmy. <laughs> like little glass marbles. You're not coming out. back, are you? Ah, you You're know. not coming back, are you? Just gonna go sneaking <sighs> off. Not tell anybody. Not tell mom. What were you gonna do? You gonna drop a car telling her how we set up house and all? <laughs> I wanna go home. You know, Donna, putting the best apples on top is the onlyest way I know how to live. So don't tell me. and see you? Get in. I gotta talk to you. Right now, I wanna go home, take a shower. I'm hot and sweaty. Why'd you leave me there the other night? The flappers? Why do you think? You two fighting like that? The cops all around? You could have done something, Billy. You could have helped. Helped? You two rolling on the floor like a couple of animals? I had to go to jail. What a big girl, you'll live. The cop came to see me, Reynolds. Reynolds? The black guy? He came into the shop. What do you want? 
who wanted a donut. What'd you say to him? Everybody's always yelling at me, Billy. What am I supposed to do? What'd you do? I told him. You told him? Nothing about you. Are you out of your mind? They don't think you did anything. He doesn't think. Who cares what he doesn't think? He's a cop! All you think about is your own damn ass! You think you're the only person in this world? What? What about Marlene, huh? What about Brian? Let him go to jail. What about me? Just tell me to keep my mouth shut. That solves everything, right? And who's thinking about me? Me, that's who. And I'm getting sick of it. Doesn't pay off, because all I ever do is take all your shit. Because you asked for it. Talking to Marlene, talking to the cops. You're going to get burned playing I like that. I've already been burned, and I had enough. I don't believe this. You leaving? Yeah, you're damn right I'm leaving. That's right. Go on, get out of here. Leave each other alone. Shut your head. Get out of here. Hey, Reynolds knows you're going. Yeah, Salvucci must have taken a fit doing the counter all by himself. I said a cop was in talking to you. He said yesterday you weren't in at all. I told him I didn't know anything about it. Where are the kids? Tommy sneezed, so Lisa took him to the night clinic. She knows a nurse up there. Jimmy's gone, huh? Well, they all leave sooner or later. That's why man invented the truck. What did he say to you about when he's coming back? He didn't say anything. He never does. How can you stand it not knowing when? I don't like the suspense. It's not knowing if that bothers me. That's why I'm redoing the bathroom. What? He's always complaining about it, so I figure if he comes back, he'll stop complaining. If he doesn't, I'll have a nice place to take a bath. He's not. He's not coming back. Oh? Is that opinion or fact? He told me. He told you? Yeah. I was under the impression that he was my boyfriend. I was supposed to tell you. You were supposed to tell me. Oh, that's great. That's really just great. I gotta hear this from my own daughter. Can I have one? He's married, Mom. He's got all these kids in Texas. Oh, boy, oh, boy. What were you doing with him? He was telling you all the family secrets. Did you know that? He had all those kids and everything? Of course I knew. I mean, I knew and I didn't know all at the same time. You can do that, you know. The human mind is capable of it. Didn't you care? What was I supposed to do? I'm not the police. I'm not the vice squad. I love him. Mom. Look, Donna. I don't know if you've noticed there's been more than one man in and out of here over the years. I haven't noticed your father hanging around on the doorstep. I haven't noticed Tommy's father taking him to the zoo, whatever. I like you girls, but there's some things you don't give me in the way of companionship. 
So I have to take it where I can get it. Jimmy's not so bad. It's funny. I like it. I'm gonna miss him, you know. Sorry, Mom. <coughs> yeah, me too. How come he never told you? It's not uncommon in my experience. Imagine your Billy tells you everything. I guess not. He left. He left? Yep. He's gone. I'm sorry. Yeah, me too. What was that cop been talking to you about? It was about that kid who fell off the roof, wasn't it? What are you doing up here? You know, you shouldn't be up here. I brought your clothes. Yeah, well, I have yours downstairs. I don't like you being up here. It makes me kind of nervous. What? I don't trust you white folks. No telling what you might do. Cut it out, Marlene. Brian's home. Yeah. He didn't look too glad to see me. Ah, uh, he'll get over it. I don't like it up here anymore. It's so different during the day. Yep, everybody going about minding their own business like nothing never happened. It's like a dream, ain't it? Sure is. What do you say we get out of here? You and me at the dark end. Oh, 